New year, new title sponsor, new choice for the new chase, new name. Welcome to the 2009 NASCAR Spring Cup Series Driver Guessing Game. <laughs> but be careful, this might warrant to new drivers and old drivers back then. And so it the driving in 2008, then 2009. So, without further ado, let's get this started. Can you guess this first one? Roger Penske then, then, then did very good in the 12th team. It was the mobile one, the hotel, then um, the Penske. This is the rookie, well, not the rookie, but his new debut in the 2009 Spring Cup Series in the 12th Penske Dodge joining Penske Racing. <laughs> Everybody, this is David Stremme, and I know it was black and red in the 2009 season, but when on Final Show downloaded the 09 season, it came up white and red, which was kind of insane and disappointed. <sighs> Next driver. In 2005, it was the new rookie in the 31 team joining, joining with Julius. It was a single wireless shipping right then, AT&T, then Cat. <laughs> Jeff Burton is the one who drove the 31 through... Do um 2005 through 2013. Hmm. Next driver. Tony Stewart in the 20 Home Depot, 1999 through 2008. Oh. In 2008, there were two races. There were two Home Depot cars in the hunt. It, they, were, they were racing in Atlanta and at Richmond. And in 2009, Tony Stewart gave it all up and moved on to a new sponsor, new Minecraft, a new car number, a new team. Joey Logano, folks, in the 20 car, but it, too bad he had a hard hit in the wall in the Daytona 500. Next time. But anyways, in 2004, Terry Labonte drove his last ride in the five, and it was Kyle Busch taking over, then Casey Mills. Then, it was, then in 2009, it was Mark Martin. <laughs> In 2008, Mark Martin did not have a lot of success, but in 2009, points and thumbs up. Next driver. The 
California kid drove the 48 team in 2002. And he's still doing it. In 2009, touched his four-time cup. <laughs> Jimmy Johnson's the name, folks. Hmm. In 2002, he was the rookie of the year, then clinched his first win at California in his hometown. <laughs> Next driver coming up. The 14 team started in 2006. But not in 2008. But in 2009, the 14 was back in business once again. And um, Joy Logano is taking the 20 Home Depot in the 09 season. Huh. Tony Stewart, also known as will get to work in the 14 team, plus he won the All-Star Race and the Pocono Race. <laughs> and I think the Kansas Race, I'm not sure, but anyways, next driver coming right up. He was the 2008 All-Star winner and the Coca-Cola 600 winner and the Pocono 500 winner. Hmm. And in 2009, made it and took the checker flag in the Toyota Save More 350 in 2009. Casey came in number nine, Dodge, in the Budweiser for... The, the, for the number nine in uh, joining Overwing Motorsports. In, two, in 2009, only had one win in, 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 the, in his victory. Next driver. In 1993, this man made a debut in NASCAR. Huh. He has led about more than 400 starts now in his career and driving the DuPont for so many years. <laughs> Everybody, this is Jeff Gordon, the Wonder Boy. In In 2003, the man was starting to make a debut in NASCAR. The Bush Series, then the Mexico Cup, then the Spring Cup. Hmm. Kyle Busch is the wild thing, I will tell you that. And today, and Kyle Busch almost won the Coke Zero 400. <laughs> Tony Stewart took him down on the final lap, and Tony Stewart got his 36th win over there, and there's, um, third. Can you guess who's next to? The Blue Deuce 
Bruce were starting to drive for Rusty Wallace's retirement in 2006. His, re his last season took in 2005. Huh. Kurt Busch was the man who was driving the two Miller Lite Dodge since then. And he got a win at Bristol in, that, in 2006. And took, took the cover win in 2009 at Atlanta. <laughs> Can you guess this final driver coming right up? In the 2009 Aaron's 499, Carla was almost went across the line first, but got taken out, spun out, got airborne, and the, got into the catch fence. The 09 Men Will Rookie Color, a Chevy of Brad Keselowski, won the race, and there are rivals ever since. I think they're still rivals. <laughs> Yeah, I think so too. And uh, these cars were on the NASCAR 09 downloadable content on the Xbox 360 version. Well, I hope you enjoy. See you later.